Hey guys, it's Ainsley. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a few tricks and tips um, for cheerleading and I'm probably, maybe, possibly gonna show you my routine. Um, if you don't know, I do Magic Valley Elite um, cheer here in Idaho. I do a competitive team that is um, still traveling, but it's not, it's only like Idaho, Utah, close states like that. And yeah, I hope you enjoy it. So let's get started. Okay, so unfortunately we can't um, get all of my body in the shot is either head or legs and legs is more important so i'm going to show you first trick is going to be a forward roll so to do a forward roll or a somersault it's the same thing um you're gonna jump up swing around up and stand the second trick is going to be a backwards roll which is a little bit trickier same thing, you're gonna, you're gonna jump up, swing back, and back down. Next trick is going to be a handstand. So to do a handstand, you're just gonna put the best leg that you are, mine is left. Um, some people say if you write with your left hand, then your good leg is gonna be your left, but I write with my left or with my right hand and I'm better at my right or my left. Holy cow words. <clears throat> so it doesn't really matter like what hand you write with, it just matters what leg like, you're best with, I guess. Um so you're gonna put your best foot forward, raise your hand up. Oh my back popped. Fourth trick. I think we're on um is going to be a cartwheel so again i'm best at my left leg so i'm going to do my left leg in front whoa you're gonna try and stay on the line i have a mat in front of me and there's a line on it so you're gonna try to stay on the line with your toes and then i'll show you my bad leg it's pretty bad, so just bear with me. Oh no. The fifth trick is going to be a round off. Whoa. That was scary. So the round off, again, put whatever leg you're best at in front. I like to hurdle just because it gives me a little more power. So you're going to hurdle up and snap. Let me try one more for you. I'll do a standing one this time. So you're just gonna stand around and snap. Oh, three rounds. The next trick is going to be, oh, I skipped a handstand for a roll. I was gonna go with like difficulty level, but I guess not, because I skipped it. So I'm gonna do a handstand forward roll. So I'm kind of bad at these because they are like one of the hardest tricks I've learned. So just bear with me. So you're going to do a handstand. Oh, oh. Sometimes that happens. The very first time I did it, it was good. Like when I was practicing. Let me try one more. Yes. Way better. Okay, so kind of yikes because that handstand forward roll still not the best so i'm gonna redo just one more time oh my gosh why okay apparently not one more time three more times apparently yes that's pretty good i'm happy with that okay so the next trick is gonna be a one-handed cartwheel um you don't have to pass this off. It's not a trick that they teach you, but it's fun to learn and it's honestly one of my favorites. So, here we go. <laughs> 
I'll stick. Shush. <laughs> and then I'm going to try one more because I felt like that was not the best. That was a little better. <laughs> okay. Next trick. Whoa. Next trick I'm going to show you is my back bend. So, here it goes. I'm scared. <laughs> These are kind of scary, but it's fine. I think I got it down. So, here we go. Yes! I can come up, but, well, I'll show you coming up, I guess. I will show you guys, just for you. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> Put me in my throat. Okay, here we go. Ooh. Oh, ouchie. That hurt. <laughs> Okay, the next trick I'm going to show you is one that is a little bit hard to show with soccer on. So, it's called a front limber. For those of you who don't know, it's a handstand fall into a bridge and then stand up if you can. So, here we go. <clears throat> Sometimes that happens, <laughs> but hey, at least that was the front limber part, right? Okay, so that front, front limber was a little rough, but hey, at least I tried. I'm not the best at those yet. The next trick, Austin, be quiet. <laughs> the next trick I'm going to show you are jumps. Um, I really like jumps, so please enjoy. <laughs> The first jump, the first jump I'm going to show you is a toe touch. I have to do it this way, otherwise I'm going to kick the table and I'm going to hurt myself. Um, so, I'm going to do it this way and then the rest of them I'll be showing you this way. Okay, so toe touch. You're going to go 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, next type of jump is called a pike jump. So here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, next jump is called a left hurdler. So let's do it. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so the next trick is kind of just for fun. I made it up, but you can follow along if you want. So first you're gonna get in a straddle like this and you have to have enough room behind you for a roll. You're gonna go all the way forward. Then you're gonna push off and around and into the splits. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and turn on notification bells. Share with your friends and family, and I'll see you next week. Bye!